and the mercies of God. I prophesy into your life. Let God's goodness, let God's mercy locate you wherever you are. And may the Lord begin to set a table before you in the very presence of your enemies. May God set a table before you in the presence of your enemies. May God show you his goodness. A door that was shut, I command that door to open. Anything that has been delayed and denied you, which was yours, I command it to be released to you now in the name of Jesus. This week, you shall see the goodness and the message of God. Amen. Believe. Listen to this prophetic direction. Listen to it very carefully. My wife and I, we did it. And therefore, I'm asking you to also do it because of the nature of the prayer line. Sometimes we come on and the Holy Spirit is, is leading us into different dimensions and directions. So I cannot guarantee. But this is the prophetic direction for the next 40 days. During these 40 days, fasting and prayer and i encourage you to join this 40 days fasting and prayer and i'll tell you the truth your life will never be the same and the theme of this fasting and prayer is fresh oil thou anointed my head with oil fresh oil a car no matter how new beautiful nice luxurious it is even having gas in it if that car does not have oil the car will not be able to move. A car without oil, the engine, engine will break and the car will be useless. You have a beautiful car, but it cannot move. Some of us, because of lack of oil on our head, that's the reason why we have not been able. Every year in and year out, we step in with resolutions, dreams, visions, aspirations, desires, and we can't manifest or see them come to fusion. Why? Because we lack oil. The Bible says that you prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. When God is about to prepare you a table before your enemies and do a sign and a wonder in your life, he must make sure that you anoint my head with what? oil because it's that oil that will preserve and protect the blessing god is giving you many have received blessings many have received victories and breakthrough only to lose it why because they didn't carry oil but this year with the fresh oil coming upon you you'll be able to fulfill dreams and vision so join us in this 40 days fasting and ask god to anoint you with fresh oil and then when the oil came the bible says that you anointed my hair with oil. My cup ran over. Immediately, oil comes. Your cup of blessing, your cup of breakthrough, your cup of favor, your cup of deliverance begin to what? Run you over. And then he says that surely, surely, certainly of the truth, verily, verily, goodness and mercy shall follow me. Once God's oil of grace comes upon you, Surely this year, this month, this week, today, God's goodness and mercy, and this goodness and mercy following you, they are not just words, they are angels. These angels will begin to accompany you, assist you wherever you go. So that everywhere you go, people begin to favor you, open doors to you, appreciate you, recommend you, and, and are able to affirm and endorse you advertise you why because the angels of god is making sure that they do you good and show you kindness and and, and and accept you and favor you there are people because of lack of oil rejection and disappointment is what follows them everywhere they go wherever you go disappointment wherever you go rejection so please join this fasting and let your destiny be changed so that goodness and mercy angels will follow you when you go to work you go for an interview you will get the interview a, a, a man of god comes into your life or a woman of god comes into your life they will end up marrying you you go to take an exam you will pass you go into school and you will graduate why because now goodness and mercy are following you making sure that everything that you do you succeed the fasting is from 6 a.m to 6 p.m and during the fasting, we drink water and we break at 6 p.m. Now, when we, we break, break, I want you to have the list I told you. First, your five, a one list. 
a list of a list a paper with a list of your five prayer requests five things you want god to do for you before the end of the year you write down your five prayer requests five things you want god to answer you speedily this year that's your number one five prayer requests list them lord i want you to help me to get a job i want you to help me pay this you write down your five immediate prayer requests that's your number one the next one is your resolution another list of paper another paper or the back of that paper you write your resolution what are your resolution for the year you write it down then the next one is never again things you went through last year that you don't want to see a repeat this year you write it also and then the fourth one is salvation package family members friends and loved ones you know are not saved that you want god to save them this year that you which you'll be praying for them five things your five prayer requests five things you want god to do for you speedily your resolution things you want to accomplish by the end of the year another list you let you you itemize them second never again what are the attitudes behaviors and what were some of the negative things that the enemy came up against you last year that you don't want to repeat what are your personal bad behaviors and personal thoughts that you don't want to be manifesting them this year to block your miracle and what were some of the attacks from your enemies or challenges you went through last year pain and sorrow hurt that you went through last year that you don't want to see this year another list and then finally salvation list for family members that you are going to be praying for them that god will bring them to the saving knowledge of jesus christ so that they will be born again know jesus and be saved for list during this 40 days fasting make sure that before you when you break the fast or during the fasting you are praying on this prayer point you are hot praying this prayer point you are praying it you take your five your five prayer requests and you pray them you take your never again and you pray them then you take prayer concerning re your resolution you pray them and finally prayer for salvation you pray them for list and if you do this prophetic direction in the next 40 days you shall see what god will begin to do just as he says you will prepare a table you will see what god will begin to you will experience divine visitation in your life in your family as you fast and seek the face of god and i'll encourage you to also get an olive oil which you anoint your head whenever we meet you bring it alongside so that you will, you anoint your head and ask the lord to anoint you and bless your life tomorrow what i just taught you i'm going to walk you through it today i've told you so get the list tomorrow we will do it we'll go through it so we can pray it after that point you have to be doing it on your own every single day whether during the fasting or after your fasting make a time at least 30 minutes and pray on these four issues your personal five prayer points your resolution for the year your never again list and salvation prayers for family members 30 minutes one hour you you can pray and god will answer you when we are when, when you are fasting make time to pray during this fasting forget about facebook youtube twitter whatever it is and spend time in the word spend time in prayer spend time in worship you shall see how you will experience the presence the power the glory signs and wonders as divine visitation in your life don't let this fasting be in vain enforce the word and enforce the purposes of god into your life and you shall see the glory every evening we'll be meeting at 11 p.m eastern time us to pray 11 p.m eastern time us to pray 4 a.m for those of you in london and 5 a.m for those of you in europe will be meeting to pray on the prayer line if you are in us it will be 11 p.m eastern time europe 4 a.m europe will be 5 a.m london will be what 4 a.m and you can join us live 
on our Facebook, which is KL Blessing. And also the YouTube, we have KL Blessing and another YouTube channel called Fresh Fire Prayer Line. Subscribe to both of them and then join us. If you need any information about the ministry, our books and all that, you can get it on our website, www.freshfireprayer.com www.freshfireprayer.com Tomorrow's scripture reading is what? Psalms 20. No, no, no. no. Proverbs. Proverbs chapter 12. Proverbs chapter 12. Tomorrow, our scripture reading is Proverbs chapter, chapter 12. We'll also be having Bible studies at 7 p.m. tomorrow, Eastern time. Amen. Take your communion. During these 40 days, we'll be taking communion. So get your new communion and we'll be taking communion within the 40 days this year god says we should be taking communion during our fasting seasons our fasting seasons so today we are taking communion and we are going to pray that the lord will cause people even before the end of this week to experience his goodness and his mercy father we thank you lord for this 40 days fasting and prayer as we seek you for fresh oil for the Bible says that those who wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up on wings like eagle. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. Lord, as we wait upon you in fasting and prayer, renew our strength in the name of Jesus. Pour fresh oil, fresh anointing, fresh power, fresh zeal, fresh grace upon us to love you with all our heart, all our soul, all our mind, to love to obey your commandment, to love to read your word, to love to serve you, to love, O oh Lord, to shun evil and to delight in righteousness. I pray, O oh Lord, that Father God, during these 40 days and 40 days fasting and prayer, may you, O oh God Almighty, pour fresh oil upon us, oil that will help us throughout the 365 days days in this year oil that will empower us embolden us strengthen us and see us through the whole year without growing weaker and weary and quitting and being discouraged father let fresh oil come upon your children in the name of jesus and i pray also that oh lord as we partake of the communion may you strengthen us and set a table before us in the presence of our enemies. I pray for your children, whoever is surrounded by enemies, who are wishing their downfall, who are wishing their demise, who are wishing their disgrace, who are wishing their embarrassment and disappointment, who want to see them humiliated. Father, this week, this day, I prophesy your word into their lives. Father, begin now. Let your angels begin now to prepare a table before their enemies. I'm praying for you that God will set a table before you in the very presence of these enemies who have risen up against you. May the Lord set a table before you in the presence of your enemies. May the Lord put your enemies to shame. May the Lord clothe them with disgrace. May the Lord humiliate your enemies. Those who wish your downfall, may the Lord cause them to perish. May the Lord cause their evil intention against you to backfire, to bounce back against them. May the Lord show you his salvation. I pray that this week you shall see the goodness, the mercies of God, the angel of goodness, the angel of mercy will follow you. Wherever you go, it will assist you. It will lead you and guide you into your place of blessing and cause goodness and mercy to come to you from all sorts of places. May people be good to you. May divine helpers locate you to be good to you. May doors of opportunity open to you. I, By the goodness and mercies of God, let the spirit of rejection and disappointment begin to disconnect themselves from you. In the name of Jesus, by this oil and grace coming upon your life, this week you will have a testimony, you have a praise report, you have a good news. In the name of Jesus, as you partake of the communion, anyone who is sick in their body, I declare and decree that by the stripes of Jesus, you are healed. By the stripes of Jesus, you are healed. I send for the word of healing and deliverance into your body. I rebuke every pain. I rebuke every sickness. I rebuke every attack of the enemy of, over your body, organs, and tissues and cells. I curse every cancer of cells. I curse diabetes. I curse high blood pressure. I curse COVID. I curse cancer. I curse every virus. I curse every bacteria. I curse every attack on your liver. Every attack on your prostate. Every attack on your heart. Every attack on your lungs. Every attack on your eyes. Every attack 
on your on, 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 on any part of your body which is being demonized by spirit of infirmity. I rebuke the spirit of infirmity out of your body. Anyone hearing the sound of my voice who is under any witchcraft attack, in the name of Jesus, by the oil of the anointing, I command the yoke of the devil over your life to be broken as you drink the blood of Jesus Christ. Receive your immediate instant healing and deliverance in the name of Jesus. Let the sick, let the oppressed be set loose and free. In Jesus name and I prophesy that this week even within 24 hours may somebody receive goodness and mercy somebody let your job call you the interview went let them call you and give you that job somebody a man you are expecting let it be released now a man you are expecting let it be released now in the name of Jesus somebody as you hear the sound of my voice may the Lord begin to visit your home with peace love and understanding that chaos in your marriage i release peace into your marriage i release understanding to your marriage i release love into your marriage i rebuke the spirit of divorce the spirit of separation i curse every witchcraft attack on your life receive deliverance from the powers of darkness in jesus name we pray amen amen say it is done Done. Three times. It is, done. it is done. It is done. It is done. In Jesus' name. In Jesus name. Join us tomorrow as the fasting continues. And let us continue to press on for fresh oil, fresh anointing. Get your list ready. And when you break the fast, pray. Tomorrow I'll give you scriptures that you'll be using for these things. And as you do obey the prophetic direction, you will see signs, wonders, and miracles. God bless you. And I look for Hi. Join us every day for prayers and for deliverance every day 11 p.m eastern time us 11 p.m eastern time us and also for those of you who are in london it's going to be 4 a.m london and if you are in europe any part of europe it will be 5 a.m join us for our daily prayer deliverance and breakthrough prayers you can join us by connecting to our youtube live and facebook live we have two youtube accounts the first one is called fresh fire prayer line fresh fire prayer line so subscribe to fresh fire prayer line and click the bell and you'll be notified whenever we meet for prayers and also we have another account called k l blessing K E Y and our blessing is E L B L E S S I N G. K a blessing. Subscribe to the K a blessing YouTube account and click on, on the bell and you'll be notified. And also you can follow us on Facebook. K a blessing. K a blessing. K A Y E L B L E S S I N G. K a blessing. Follow us also on Facebook. So do change um, um join us every day for prayers every day for those of you in us 11 p.m eastern time london 4 a.m and those of you in europe 5 a.m for any further information about deliverance materials and books go to our website www.freshfireprayer.com www.freshfireprayer.com and you can purchase our materials from there God richly bless you, and I look forward to seeing you today for prayers. I pray for you that whatever you are believing God for, may the Lord God Almighty wipe away the tears from your eyes. May the Lord remove shame from your life. May the Lord mend your broken heart and heal you. May the Lord restore whatever the devil has stolen from your life, and may the Lord open doors for you in the name of Jesus. Every burden, every challenges you are going through, I want you to know that with prayer, God is able to do the impossible. I pray that the Lord God Almighty bring you deliverance. And may the Lord Almighty deliver you from every spells, every charms, every hexes, every attack of the enemy that is going on right, right now in your life. As I pray for you right now, let the attack stop and cease in the name of Jesus. And for those of you believing God for a breakthrough, I come into agreement with you. Let there be miracles. Let there be a breakthrough. Let there be testimony. Let there be praise report. Before you even join us, you are going to come with a testimony because our God is awesome and is able to do all things. He's a way maker. He's a miracle worker. He's a promise keeper. He's a God who is able to divide the rest. 
and causes people to walk on on dry land i so i prophesy in the name of jesus whatever blessing breakthrough you are believing god for may the lord answer you speedily in the mighty name of jesus christ be restored be healed be delivered i pray for god to restore your marriage in the name of jesus i ask the lord to restore your health i ask the lord to open the door for you to get your job i ask the lord god almighty to release a blessing in your family in the name of jesus those who are sick be healed right now be delivered right now be restored right now in the name of jesus doors that were shut before you i command your closed doors to begin to be open and may you experience the favor of God, whatever spell, whatever charm, whatever hexes that has been done against you to destroy you, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, by the resurrection of the anointing, I break every yoke, I break every charm, I break every witchcraft of your life, and I lose you by the power of the Holy Ghost. For the Bible says, whatever we lose on earth shall be loose in heaven. I command your release from every powers of darkness, from every curse, from every bewitchment, and from every shackles. I break the yoke of the enemy of your life, and I command your soul to escape as a bird out of the snare of the father may the snare be broken and i command your unconditional release right now receive your testimony receive your breakthrough this week receive your healing this week i ask the lord to restore your marriage your family your sons and daughters let them be covered let them be protected by the precious blood may the blood preserve and protect you from all evil from cancer from diabetes high blood pressure from covid from premature death from accident from a, uh, uh, misfortune and adversity and calamity any evil, any weapon that has been formed or fashioned or designed against you, may the Lord cause you to escape the traps and the snares of your enemies. May your life be preserved by the Lord Jesus Christ. Join us today and your life will never be the same. This is Reverend K, a blessing. For more information, go to our website, www.freshfireprayer.com, www.freshfireprayer.com, and click and subscribe to the YouTube channel, Facebook channel, Fresh Fire Prayer Line, also, K, a blessing, and follow us on Facebook. K, a blessing. God richly bless you. Bye. Hi, this is Reverend K, and once again, welcome to Fresh Fire Prayer Ministry. I'm here to recommend to you some deliverance materials which will help you. The Bible says, Buy knowledge and sell it not. Buy knowledge and sell it not. You have to, re you have to discover in order to recover. If you don't discover the mystery behind your misery, you'll not be able to recover and possess or repossess your possession. So knowledge is very vital in this day and age because what you don't know is what the enemy or your enemies will use against you. And that's why the U.S. spent huge sums of money using it for intelligence because they'll have to know what their enemies are planning against the U.S. before they, in order to overturn it, cancel it, frustrate it before their enemies can come against them. So the Bible says that we are not ignorant of the devices of the enemy. So many people are looking for deliverance, seeking for deliverance, but they are very ignorant about the ways the devil operates and they keep on falling into the devil's trap and the devil keeps on getting them. The first book I recommend to you is called Spiritual Diagnosis. Mind you, you can get all these books on our website www.freshfireprayer.com www.freshfireprayer.com You can get it on a paper book or you can get it on ebook. In the ebook, when you buy it, it will be emailed to you as an attachment and you can open it and get it. You go to the website www.freshfireprayer.com The first book is Spiritual Diagnosis. Spiritual Diagnosis is the first book I wrote after the Lord revealed to me the way the enemy operates against humanity. The way witchcraft operate, curses operate, demons operate. In this book, you will understand how the enemy operates. You are going to learn about the portals which the enemies or demons can enter into your body. You, you know how demons also operate. You also know how to keep your deliverance, how to keep, um, stay delivered. What can keep you from receiving deliverance? You know the different ways the enemy can attack you either through witchcraft, either through curses, either through spirit husband, either through your name, either through against your marriage. This, are, this book was exposed to you. Anybody who wants to know about deliverance and about the ways the demons and the witches operate, how witches can hunt down your star, how witches can um, you turn you into scapegoat in order to destroy you, this book will give you all the vital 
information you need for your deliverance and it will help you. Body afflictions. How many people are going through attacks on their body? Demonic visitation. Demons in, in, uh, visiting you. Witchcraft, kid goods. Evil soul ties. I explain to you how all these things oppress Asmodeus and Osmodeus. These are demons that breaks marriages and keep people single. Satanic spiders and spider web. Every time you experience a spider web in your life. Satanic monitors. Demons and witches monitoring you. Evil authors and covenant that are affecting your body, are uh, affecting your life. You learn all star hunters, demons and witches that are after your star and your glory, and how they can pursue after your star to destroy you. How to use the anointing oil, how to anoint your house. These are all, uh, and how, how to do self deliverance. This book, Spiritual Diagnosis, Spiritual Diagnosis. The other one is called Deliverance from Blessing Destroyers. This book gives you 30 dreams that shows you that your blessings and your prosperity is under demonic and witchcraft attacks. 35 prayer to cancel demonic dreams and, uh, and against your life. Are you, have you been having evil dreams? Have you been having bad dreams? Do you understand the dreams? Do you know how to pray to reverse it, to destroy it? How to overcome the four major causes of the poverty? You will discover what causes poverty and the 11 witchcraft activities. 11 witchcraft activities to destroy your blessings and your destiny. You also learn about the 16 demons that attack our finances. Prayers to overcome demonic operation against your blessings. Uh, prayers to, uh, against witchcraft activities. And nice spiritual element for your, your blessings. Deliverance from blessing destroyers. Emergency prayers. For marriage restoration, anybody going through marital problem, anybody wanting to get married, anybody wanting to know how to pray against witchcraft, against marine demons, against strange women, against household wickedness, against spouse, uh, spouse charms, against your marriage, and how to pray to preserve your marriage, get this book, Deliverance from Blessing Destroy, uh, Emergency Prayers for uh, Marriage Restoration, any marriage under attack, this is your book. Consuming Fire for Fire, this is the book that you need in order to teach you how to pray against the spirit husband, spirit wife, python spirit, leviathan spirit, witchcraft spirit, demonic spirit, strange woman, come against singleness, spirit of delay, spirit of uh, satanic embargoes, anything, anybody who is going through witchcraft, this is the book. And if you want to know how to pray against a witch, get this book and it will teach you how to pray against witchcraft and get your deliverance. Emergency prayers for marriage restoration. Emergency prayers. Urgent prayers. This urgent prayers against the strong man. This book will teach you how to pray against back to sender. Anybody who releases evil arrow against you, how to send it back to the sender. This um, book will also teach you how to pray to open every satanic padlock that has padlocked your destiny and your star. This book will teach you how to pray against the spirit of death, sicknesses, and diseases, especially cancer. And this book will also teach you how to pray for favor in um, for your life. And if you are dealing with any strong man, the spirit of Pharaoh that is holding you in bondage and captivity, this is the book you need. Emergency prayer for uh, urgent prayer against the strong man. Get this book and it will bless you. Touch not my anointed. If you don't want witches and wizards to mess you up, this is the book to get. And once you, you begin to use it, you will get, begin to get your deliverance from all the powers of darkness. Get, go to our website, www.freshfireprayer.com. www.freshfireprayer.com. Get these materials. Start reading them. Start praying these prayers in the midnight hour or every time you have and start praying them. Use this prayers and pray it and it will change your life and it will help you to fight against the powers of darkness and your life and your destiny will never be the same. Go to our website www.freshfireprayer.com www.freshfireprayer.com If you order the uh, ebook, you will get it within 24 hours uh, and we will email it to you as an attachment. If you order the paperback, you give us uh, four to five days and it will be emailed to you, uh, it will be sent to you and it will help you out to get your deliverance. God richly bless you. Bye.